I know people. Uh, I hit the start button too soon. Sorry. Give me a minute. Give me a minute. Hey, 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 everybody. How are you? Give me a second here. I hit my start button too soon. Yeah. Hang on. Two, one, boom. Guess what I got? A long awaited package. Seems like it's been long though. And it was a big one too. I got some. Oh, I'm gonna drop everything now. What the heck was that? I know something dropped. Um, oh, I have to look for it in a minute. Probably something I want. How's everybody? Oh, you are! How awesome! Is it awesome? Is that good? You moving back? Cool. Hey, I'll show you what's in my box, but I want to go ahead and do my face first because I said we would do the face first. And we're going to do a full face, so uh, let's get started, okay? Try not to make this one as long as I usually do because, man, I'm a motor mouth. Okay, I took my shower last night. Didn't take one this morning. <laughs> so, I'm going to use my um, Magic Micellar. I want to use that first. And I think what I'm going to do is, you saw my regimen last night, if you watched me. This is Marsha Holland, Glam Memo. Um, I love to use my cellar first. It's like it sucks things up out from under the surface of the skin. So you can think you've got clean skin and by George, you'll use this and you'll get something else up, I promise. I did a mask last night, that clay mask. Oh my gosh, that was good. That was good. Okay, good. This is my cellar, it's so awesome. I don't wanna ever be without it. You can get it at Walmart, but I guarantee it's not as good. And I have, I've got some right there as a matter of fact. Uh, I think today I'm going to go easy, easy, easy on my products. I'm just going to do the full face mask because the reason I say that is I got to clean this room up. So let's just get a little bit of moisturizer on. I want to use my rose, my rose series. Oh my gosh, I keep thinking the little rose petals are going to pop right out of here. <laughs> yeah, so we're just going to use that. I'm not going to do the serums or the other stuff because I will be doing that all tonight oh yeah <laughs> mm -mm -mm. roses smell so good God did such a good job on that that work huh now we're gonna do I am gonna do primer I always do primer guys always always this is the if Oh, you know what? I was supposed to try to go live in a one of those makeup groups. This one's in Pakistan. They've been wanting me to do a lot a live in there, and I forgot. Shoot, I meant to. Anyway, let me tell you something. I am knee deep in poop. Anybody got any suggestions? I got one of my dogs, and I, I thought it was the pup, but now I'm not sure. It might be Bentley. He is pooping everywhere. It's disgusting. And I've stepped in it twice. I can't stand that. But I have no idea what he could have gotten into, if anything at all. So I'm thinking somebody's going to have to go to the vet. Can you give dogs Pepto-Bismol? Hi, Karen. Thank you. I love that you love my lives, and I love that you're here. Can you give dogs Pepto-Bismol? Somebody tell me that. Let me tell you why I'm saying that. Because if it is Bentley that's sick, he gets violently sick at both ends when he gets in the car. So, <laughs> if I could, you know, not have to get him in the car, that would be the greatest thing ever. 
All right, guys. Let me ask you something. Do you want me to use, what foundation do you want me to use? Do you want me to use BB cream? Do you want me to use the Stay Matte? Do you want me to use Luminous Serum? Do you want me to use the VFX Pro, CC Cream, Pata Cream? What would you like to see? Because, man, I got it all. I will Google it. Oh, good, Jessica. I'm from Texas, too. Yay. So excited. Isn't pharmacy just the best? It's just absolutely unreal. Yeah, here's the new catalog. Look at that. It's beautiful. Yes, I, I like the way they do their catalogs. One side will be the cosmetic side. You flip it over, and here's Dr. Tuna's stuff, the skincare stuff. Isn't that cool? Nifty. And this is also, let me tell you, this is bilingual. So it's in English and Spanish. I haven't even looked through the new catalog yet. Okay. Anybody? Anybody? I'm going to grab, I'm going to grab, I'm going to grab, grab, grab a uh, foundation. If you don't tell me which one you want to see. You've got Stay Matte. This is like, it's a poor mineral, minimizer. It's a mineral enriched. Uh, sebum control is good for oily skin. I don't have oily skin, but I like it anyway. Here is the Luminous Serum Foundation, which is good for dry skin. Good morning, good morning, California. And here is the VFX Pro. It's good for all skin types. It's the full coverage. And then here's uh, one of my favorites, the CC Cream, which is color correcting. And it says that it's uh, light coverage but i swear i get good coverage with these with the cc cream and here's the bb cream the bb cream is also light coverage has spf in it uh what else i got pata cream pata cream is a full coverage uh pata 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 i use number 02 color isn't the rose out of this world? Oh no, guys. Hey, is anybody else freezing up? Please tell me I'm not freezing. Anybody else freezing? Okay, I got to vote for the VFX full coverage. This is it right here, guys. The full coverage. Krista, am I still frozen? Shoot, am I frozen anywhere else? I hope not. Look what I got. I'm, gonna, I'm not going to tell you what it is just yet. I'm going to show you, and I have no idea how this old lady's going to do it. That, that's all you see. <laughs> I'm going to show you in a minute. I screwed up on my order, man. My little finger gets hot, hot, hot whenever I'm hitting that uh, add to cart button. And I ended up ordering three of one thing. Uh... Two of another when I only meant to do one and then I didn't get all of them and I ended up uh, I didn't pay attention okay we'll do the full coverage and I think today I haven't used this in a while we'll use my little blend smart uh, we'll use my little blends maybe we will hang on my brush may not be too clean let me check let's clean it a little bit huh my battery operated brush. Where is it? Oh, there it is. There it is. Let me get all these out. Okay. Okay, okay. Good on your end? Okay, good. <gasps> Hope it's not freezing. Hope it's not freezing. Okay, I'm going to use my little, if the battery's good, let me check. Yeah, this little battery operated. It's called Blend Smart. Um, I did have a code, but I didn't know that my code was a temporary code. So I've been handing out this code to everybody. 
I don't know if it's any good or not. It was like Glam Mama. Not Glam Mama, but Glam Mama 2.0. And you get 20% off. This is the VFX Pro full coverage. And it's in the color 02. So we're going to use that today because it was requested. And first thing I do is just kind of dot it on before I start my little battery thing going. Supposedly, you're supposed to use, you can use less product with this one. So, and then you don't go in circles. You go up and down or you go sideways. And the reasoning behind that is it's going in circles for you. So, it's habit though to want to go in circles, isn't it? I like it. It feels good to your skin. But blendsmart.com, if you go look, I want to say it's 60 something dollars for the whole unit and one brush. And of course, they've got all these other brushes. <laughs> I've got several brushes. I'll show you. This isn't an advertisement for them, though. This is Pharmacy. This is your full coverage. Color O2. I was looking at mirrors yesterday at Bed Bath & Beyond. Oh my gosh. One mirror was like $150. And it was just a big mirror. Okay. How's that? You know how I can tell if it's full coverage or not? I have a little tiny brown spot right there, which I'm going to work on with our new stuff that's coming out. The whitening. The whitening, it's not out yet. You can get, sam I can get samples of it, but the series itself is not uh, launched yet. It's white plus correct. And there's one for brown spots, one for under the eyes that helps with bags and dark circles and wrinkles. Covers all of it. Yeah. So I'm going to, you know, try that when it comes out. I'll let you know when it gets here. Okay. So do I want to do anything here? Do I want to? You know what we can use today? Let's use... How many of you have used the It Cosmetics Under the Eye Cream? Have y'all used that? I have some of this and I bought it quite some time ago. And let me tell you, it was kind of pricey. So we will see. We can use a little bit of this right there. I always use my color correcting uh, soft peach and bisque coverage um, concealer. You know what? I got this sitting here staring at me and I'm thinking, you know, I can't stand to waste it. So let's just see what it does. This is It Cosmetics and it's kind of thick. Uh, it's very thick. <laughs> and it almost looks like a highlighter. <laughs> we'll fix that. Maybe I put too much on. Let's, let's be fair. Let's be fair. Tarte Tape also has, I mean, there's a thing called tart tape. I hear my dog trying to get in, making him stay out because I think he's the one with the upset stomach. Okay, this was It Cosmetics. Kind of thick for me. Kind of thick. Didn't put any more product on. I'm just using what's on the brush. Okay, ta-da. Now, we will use the powder. What kind of powder do I want to use today? I am a powder user, have been for ages. I think since this is full coverage, I'll use the translucent, because I really don't need any more coverage with that, right? I'm doing good with that. I'll look at your comments in just a second, guys. 
found out yesterday I have stage five cataracts, so that explains my not being able to see. Now, when I'm doing powders, whether it's loose or this, I don't turn my little motor on until, you know, after I have done this. Especially if it's loose. Oh, it'll go everywhere. So this is a translucent. Our perfecting powder, I have actually used that as my foundation before. That and a little bit of uh, our concealer. It's that good. It is that good. Wait till you see what I got. As soon as I get my face on, I'm going to show you what I got today. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> got a new lip pencil. And I got this one from my upline. It's Christina. And she has got coal black hair, gorgeous girl, coal black hair, and she wears a, a lot of red. I don't wear red too often. I don't know why. <sighs> Come on, I broke my lid. That's okay. That's quite all right. Let's do a little bit of blush. And I, again, I'm going to use my Love Letter blush. We'll use this. And again, I'm just going to touch it and use it this the motor part for blending yeah let's don't go crazy here all right do a little at a time you can always add i don't even think i'm gonna add anything like uh, highlighter or anything like that today I get too dressed up, I'll have to go somewhere. And I need to stay home and clean up this junk room here. Yeah. And if you think you get too much on, easy fix, easy peasy fix. Just get that powder brush and just go over it. I don't do my apples with a lot of product because when you get older, you're supposed to make people's eyes draw up here, not down here. So if I have something left on my brush, you know, then I'll do the apples, but I don't really add product to the apples. I just don't. Okay. Good job, Marsha. Good job. Now we're ready for those eyes. And I'm going to have to, uh, I don't know, I may have to read a little bit here for a second. Let me look something up in my new catalog. Uh-oh. Somebody said something ugly. Uh-oh. Hi, Jill. Oh. <laughs> oh. Egypt. Okay. We can block if, I, if somebody tells me how. Okay, the, I'm looking for the thing I got today, and I don't want to tell you about it, I just want to surprise you with it, but this brand new catalog, let me, let me find them, let me find it, oh my goodness, come on now, Marsha, oh, we got some new waterproof eyeliners, oh, where are they? They should be in the eyes. Hang on. Mono eyeshadows. Not the glitter. Not the trio. I did get a new trio. I'll show you that. Here they are. Whoa. Let me see if they give instructions. You can use what I'm going to do. You can use it on your eyes. Um, you can use it on your lips, and you can use it on your nail polish. You can mix it in with translucent nail polish. See, I did not get that color. I got that, 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 and I didn't get that, and I didn't get that. So I got one, two, three that I didn't get. Ooh, that's pretty. So... I think I know what I'm going to do now. Okay. Surprise, surprise. Let's do some eyebrows first. We are just going to use the brow, brow mascara first. We'll make it simple. Okay. 
my growth serum for my eyebrows and my eyelashes is working girls now this you can smear this all over your skin if you're not careful so I'm trying to go real light just try my best just to get this on the brow hairs themselves. Just to, I just want a little bit of color, a little bit of shape. See there? Makes a difference, right? But not too much. This brow is going through some uh, problems. Probably, oops, see there, I got a blob on there. Uh, uh, get off. Let's get it. Let's get it before it dries. That's the brow mascara, guys. Brow mascara. That's good enough. That's all I'm going to do, because I'm going to put a lot of stuff on my eyes here. Do I get one darker than the other? I don't think so. It's just fun. It's cold here. The brush is www.blendsmart.com. And I'm not sure if my code works anymore. It may or it may not, but it, the code is GLAMMAMA20. Yeah. Hi, Angie. How are ya? Let's see if I missed anything. Okay, good. We're not freezing, are we? All right, so now I am gonna do some eye primer. Crime not to crime, especially what I'm fixing to do. Uh. And then, since I, I'm trying to hurry, because as soon as we get this stuff on, I'll show you my box of goodies. I didn't know it was coming today. They're working on the uh, communications about our packages and stuff. Um, Like, I don't really get a tracking number right now. But when I go in my back office, I can see whether it has been packed or not. And usually it means, if it says packed, that usually means that it's shipping. And so, they're working on that part, though. I mean, we're being very patient with these people. Because they are so good. Customer service is so nice, so I don't want to stress them out. But, you know... We get excited. We want our stuff, right? That's right. But this company does so much. We are uh, giving them grace about some things. <sighs> you need to give grace to people. Give grace. 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 All righty. Oh, my gosh. Let's see. I am thinking seriously because in lieu of in lieu of what I got in today, I'm thinking about doing some glitter liner. Glitter liner. I'm thinking about that. I sure am. But I don't know what kind to use. I don't know what color to use, rather. You may have to help me out with that. <laughs> okay, I have metallic and I have glitter. This is metallic and glitter gold. Metallic and glitter gold. This is kind of a plum color. Pretty. Oh, there's another gold. I bet I've got two. Listen, I got extra stuff. I just go crazy ordering stuff. And then I don't realize it till after I've hit the start but of the end button. This is black, of course. Oops. Oh, and I got a green. Got a green, got a green, got a green. <laughs> Look at this one. Isn't that pretty? I won't do it today, but isn't that pretty? And this one is probably one of my favorites right here. It's, uh, I think it's called Crystal. It's so pretty. It's almost transparent. So I like to put it on my lid over stuff. And then I have a metallic and a crystal silver. and crystal silver. They look real close. And then I've got a charcoal. I think that's a charcoal. So, I'm thinking about 
maybe a gold because I'm gonna use something special I don't know which one to use we'll use this one here that looks more goldy 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 and you know liquids usually don't do very well with me they bleed up into my uh, tissues right here all right so and look here I've got all these pencils I can also let me think I think I'll do maybe we could do how about hmm let me look at a picture right quick I'm gonna cheat let me look at a picture silver okay, let me look well now what I'm gonna use is gonna be kind of a yellowy like pineapple so I was thinking more gold I don't know my new book yet. I don't know where to find my stuff yet. Here it is. Okay, she used, she used a black eyeliner. Okay, I'll keep that open. She used a black eyeliner. <sighs> Maybe I could do gold and do a black over it. How about that? Let's do that. And I think what I'm going to do is I am going to use, which I haven't used in a long time because not for any reason. I've just been experimenting with other stuff. I'm going to use my gel eyeliner. I love this gel eyeliner. It works better for me than liquid. So we're going to show you what I got today. And I'm not even sure how to use it. Oh my gosh. This is our, I'll go ahead and tell you what it is. This is our new pigments i know you can't see that's backwards the pigments you can use them on your lips you can use them on your eyes and you can mix it in with the clear polish and put it on your nails for crying out loud yeah pigments they're 12.90 retail but i don't know how to use them let me see if i can't even see this little tiny print i don't even think i'm gonna be able to see it even with my magnifying glass maybe hang on how to use, apply with either a dry <clears throat> or wet brush, depending on something, effect. I think we ought to do a wet brush or a dry brush. Hello from Australia, hi Christy. So today's color is going to be pineapple and let me get the other one. Hang on, I got another one. This one that I'm going to show you, I accidentally ordered three of them for crying out loud. So I ought to have plenty of it, right? Yeah. I'm going to use cosmic and pineapple today. Cosmic and pineapple today. All right, let me get it going. I think I um, maybe I'll use a wet brush. I will use my time locker. Pretty cool little lid. It's got a protective thing on it. Ooh, it's got a shaker and it's also got. Ooh, be careful. <gasps> The whole thing will come off. It's got a shaker. Let's shake it into the lid and see what happens. Yeah. yeah. Whoa, don't lose it. Okay, I'll quit playing. Oh, shoot, almost dropped it. All right, let me get my brush. I love this little brush right here. In fact, I ordered another one. I think I might just order one each time I make an order. It's a good little dense, firm-like brush, but it's got a little uh, tip on it that you can blend with and smudge with. I like to smudge it. So it's a smudger. So we were gonna do a wet. So let's do, I'll use my time locker setting spray. <laughs> oh my gosh. Exciting. Okay. Okay, we're gonna use this Cosmic first. Looking at her picture. I have no idea what the heck I'm doing. So we're playing, this is what you call play. Uh, 
Is that violet? I thought it was silver. Mm, let's see what color it is. I think it's, what is that? What color is that? It's silver, but it has a, it has a little hue to it. Oh, wow. Look at this. Ooh. Pigmented pigments. <laughs> I have no idea how it's going to wear. I have no idea how it's going to do. My first day using it. <laughs> Definitely going to get those other colors, though. I'm just going to tap it on first before I start smearing it. I'm going to put another color in the corner over here, in the inside corner. Definitely a wet brush. How about that? Whoa. This is pigments, guys. <gasps> pigments. Do I want to go all the way up? I think I do want to go under the brow with it all. Maybe I won't put any more on here and just use what's on the brush. Let's don't go too crazy. Yeah, we'll just use what's on the brush. I may have to use something else for the dimension color because it, oh wait, you know what? I was thinking this was white. This is more silver. I may have to change my game plan. Woo. It'll look better when I get all the liners and stuff like that on. Now let's see if I can't get what's in my lid back in here because you can take this little shaker lid off. That's a good thing. And then, because you know, I hate wasting anything that's in in the lid. What color did I tell you this was? I told you it was, did I tell you it was Cosmic or Eclipse? I may have even put the wrong one on. Let me look at my box. I'm thinking Cosmics, Cosmic. wrong box. I think, oh, Cosmic. Let's see. Well, it looks white in the book. But it's kind of got a lavender hue to it. You like that, Jessica? I do too, I think. Yeah. Hi, Crystal. It's going to look a whole lot better. Now, I may have to change my game plan here. I'm trying to copy what's in here and I'm not sure I can do it. We'll see. I want to use the same brush. Kind of kind of dampen it off a little. I mean wipe it off just a little bit from that silver. And this color is called pineapple. See that? Pineapple. Like that. So let's get a little bit in the lid. If I can get it. Don't mess it up, Marcia. Shake a little bit. Now I'm, not, I'm just going to use a little bit of this. Shakes out good. It's called pineapple. Ooh, that's... I better shake that off. Okay. Alright, let me see what she did. Okay. She probably didn't do it. Somebody did it. What are y'all doing on this Saturday? What's going on in Australia? It's cool here. You see, I got a, a, 
a sweatshirt like thing on okay she kind of put that pineapple in there maybe I'd better get a little more bold huh I'm going to use some wild and crazy eyelashes today. Wait and see. <laughs> I'm going to use you as my guinea pig today. <laughs> you can tell me whether I can wear them to work or not. Because they are kind of crazy. Let's do a little more. little more. You know, I'm anxious to see what it looks like in the nail polish. How would you mix it in your nail polish without doing the whole bottle? Okay, come on now. Didn't put enough. I can take this shaker off, but I'm scared to. Got a new lip pencil. I'm going to show you it. Thank you for coming to visit here on this Saturday. This is the color Pineapple Pigment. Whoa. Okay. It'll look better in a minute. I hope. Now what she do? She's got a brownish color. Let me see if I've got anything like that. I do have a bronzy. Maybe the bronzy is what she used. Get this back in there. I don't want to waste a drop. You know, I told you they were $12.90 retail. You know if you join for $20, bucks, you can get 50% discount. You sure can. 50% off all the time and it's immediate whenever you get your uh, email from corporate as soon as you join they send you an email and what do you see what I got in here uh, 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 uh. right now I'm looking for something though it's like Christmas all the time no that's cosmic Let me see, I've got Morocco. Let's see what Morocco is. I think that's kind of a bronzy color. Ooh, that's kind of a pretty color. And then I got another one. Let's see if I can figure it out. Ecl Eclipse? I don't remember. Is that the white I put on or I get confused? Oh no, Eclipse is blue. Okay, so it must be, I have one called Morocco. I haven't really, I haven't unpacked and put my box away yet because I want to show you guys. dust. Let me see what that one is. I got Morocco and bronze dust. And I bet the bronze dust is going to work. Bronze dust? Let's see what that does. Hers is more like a Maybe she used smoky on that, and I don't have the smoky, so we may have to improvise here. You know what? Let's improvise. I don't think I'll use that one. I'm going to improvise and use one of my pencils. But I see here, now that I'm looking better, she's put some on the outer edge here of this pineapple. Just a dab right there. Isn't this fun? You're not 
into makeup, you need to get into makeup, man. And for 50% off, you can afford to do it. Isn't that awesome? Okay. Now, let me, I've got some creamy pencils here. And I'm thinking since, let's see, I'm thinking silver maybe, gray. Let's do gray. Don't want to do black. Let's do the gray. I think that's gray. Can't tell. These little pencils. Let's see what this one does. This is the roll up. This one is called Extra Last. Let's see what it does for me. I have actually used our pencils as the shadows. You'll see this start to take shape here pretty soon. Now I'm just going to use like the side of the pencil and I'm just kind of smearing it on there lightly. Makeup is not just for the young and the beautiful. Makeup is for any age. There's nothing on here that says for the young and beautiful. It's for the young at heart, too. Remember I told you you had a little smudger? My dog's going to tear the door up. I hear him scratching out there. Yeah, we may have to go to the vet. See there, a little dimension? This side's always more awkward. I think because, you know, I'm right-handed, this is the left hand, and things kind of are held at a different angle. Oops, wrong brush. Hang on, I got something going on right there. Too dark right there. Too dark. Can you see where I'm going with this? I hate it whenever I've got something in my brain and it doesn't come out. Like what's in your head, you know, it doesn't come out like you want it. But this is looking pretty good. I'll show you the picture I'm looking at here in a sec. Certainly, it's not exact, but hey. It's supposed to be fun anyway. I think she did it darker. I don't know if I want to go darker. <sighs> Let's see. If you guys have any questions about what I'm doing, and remember, this right here is a pencil, one of our pencils that I am using for a shadow. They are all awesome pencils. I'm coming up over my bone also because I have hooded eyes. So I'm trying to create an illusion where you're not really focusing on my droopy eyes, you know? Would you, can y'all hear that dog? Now, whatever I use in the dimension, I like to bring it down underneath the eye. I like for that to meet. Don't like gaps. I don't have any dog in here. What's the deal? That's odd. It's dark on this side. I have to figure out which one of the dogs has a stomach ache before I start calling the vet. I have to make sure. I don't know if I should crate one of them and see what happens with a, the one that's loose, see if, you know, and then change places. I don't know. I have three little dogs. It's hard to tell, you know. I don't sit around and watch them poop. Unless I'm outside with them and I try to pay attention. Ah, Marsha, stupid. Do 
doop it, doop it, doop it. It was working. Just smudging it out. I don't want any sharp lines. right there uh these are good tools too you see me use these all the time um q-tips but these are, are not regular q-tips these are funny shaped q-tips they're pretty close pretty close okie dokie now get all my junk put away that would look like if I now, this is the other one this one you sharpen this is called uh, express pencil let's do a little bit of that in the tear line never used a silver in the tear line before I used white eyes have been through the ringer the last couple of days. It's a nice subtle color. Okay, do I still want to do the gold or do I want to do a silver liner? Mm -hmm. Hello everybody. How are you? It is fun, Elizabeth. <clears throat> it is fun. I think for contrast, for you guys, for the camera, I'll use the gold. For contrast. It's fixing to start taking shape here. Now, I haven't used this in a while, so I better shake it. I better shake it. You know what I'm going to do today? Make another order. Now I'm going to go above a little bit because I'm still going to use black. Just to give it a little bit of a contrast. And if you have a problem doing eyeliner, you can put a dot here, a dot here, and a dot here, and then connect your dots. That makes it kind of easy. This is wet, so I have got to let this kind of dry before I move on to my gel. And we're moving on to my gel. And let me see. I hope it hadn't dried out. I'm going to be mad. No, it's good. I want to use an eyebrow pomade brush tools are important <sighs> pretty sure that's dry enough so I'm just going to use this is what I'm talking about connecting the dots put a dot right here dot right there dot right there and then connect them This will give you, using this kind of brush will give you more of a, a thicker line. So if you like real thin, you want to use thinner brushes, right? Uh-oh, I may not have let it dry. Uh-oh. My bad. to let it dry and then go back over it. <laughs> okay. Okay. Lesson. Let it dry. But I'm going to go ahead and do the other one. This eye has more wrinkles. Excuse me. My nose is dribbling.
which means I do have to kind of, I'm not really pulling it, but I am kind of, sort of. As you age, things stretch out, fall south, disappear. <laughs> down a little bit you pharmacy girls do you have a favorite uh, mascara you want me to put on I do even though I do lashes I still do a little mascara just in case I lose my lash I still don't look funny ah, you know I hope I can even put the lash on. I've been experimenting with magnetic liner and magnetic lashes for a long time now, and I hope I can even do the glue anymore. There's an art to doing that, you know. I think I'm going to get that pineapple again. Or, let's see. Yeah, I'll use the pineapple again. Show you what I'm gonna do. It's looking better. See, the eyeliner makes it look better. We'll help it out a little. We'll help it out. Use the other side of my brush. Just a hint. Okay. Think I'll leave it alone. Think I'll leave it alone. Fun, fun, fun. Do you know what kind of mascara? I've got it all. You want me to use a particular one? Uh-huh. I have the 3D. I've got the Star Look. I've got Zen. I have the Deep Black. I have the Extreme Curl. And I have the All Optimal. I have enough mascara why don't we do the curl I love the star look because I like the star look because I love the brush it has a pineapple shaped brush which makes it easy to do that part right here now I'm gonna put the glue on those lashes here in a sec because they have to wait a minute that glue said it takes five seconds oh, we'll see how that works man okay, so I'm just gonna put a little mascara I wasn't doing this live, I wouldn't even be putting makeup on. Who needs makeup on to clean your room up? Oh. I love this curved brush. Just kind of fits the eye. You want to go, uh, if you're not using lashes, you would go back and forth like that to get your uh, volume, the thickness that you want. And then you would go on the tips to get the length. See, I'm not going to go to all that trouble because I am just going to put lashes on. This curved brush makes it easy to do your bottom lashes too. I see a problem right now. want to blend right right there. I don't like it to be chopped. Let's see what this one is. I need to touch that up a little bit. 
this is it. Maybe I got enough in the brush. I mean, in the thing. I've been using the yellow. I'll use the other side. The other side look doesn't look yellow. Sure you get your lid down I see that it doesn't want to go down very well to snap it <clears throat> all right let's do some glue on those lashes no I'm gonna do my mouth first I'm gonna do my lips first thank you Sonia oh I did I didn't do deep black I didn't see your comment in time sorry You know, Facebook. It's not fast enough for me. I got this new pencil. I was telling you a while ago from my uh, my upline. She wears a lot of red. She has jet black hair, so she really looks stunning in red. I don't wear a lot of red. So this is going to be out of my comfort zone. And so are those lashes. Where do you see those lashes? Barely touching it first. Try not to get out of the line. You know, these are creamy enough to use by themselves, but that lip nourishment that I put on, ooh, ooh, yeah. I've gotten where I use it all the time, and the, my lips feel so moist all the time. I'm getting bold now. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Number 206. Mercy. Look at those lips. Whew, I don't know if I have to tone that down. I don't know. Okay, let me look here. Let me look here. Let me get my, uh, these eyelashes are going to, I don't even know if I need, those kind of look, I don't, I, I, I might need to, um, where's my glue? I might need to, oh, there it is. I'm going to use that five second glue. I got two. I got one that has a dual end on it. It's got dark on one end, light or white on the other. Then there's this duo glue that dries in five seconds. <clears throat> so I gotta be ready. <clears throat> I gotta be ready. I don't know if that'll be a good thing for me or not. Five seconds. What do y'all think about red lips? I'm losing everybody. Everybody's getting bored with me. Okay, I may have to. I may have to trim these lashes. Let me look real quick. This is the Duo Quick Set. Duo Quick Set. It's white clear, dries clear. I need dry clear. It's formaldehyde, latex free. Formaldehyde free, latex free. All kinds of good. Ooh, it's got a thick brush on it. Okay, look at these lashes. 
I wonder if I have to trim them. Ow. I'm going to tear Ardell's box up. These are called double... No, they're not. They're called Mega Volume. If I can get them out... Oh my god. Maybe they just look so, so because they're so black. This is number 253. Look at that. Ooh, I bet I have to cut it. Let's see. You have to be careful when you're pulling these dudes off, too. It feels sticky already. So I'm just going to kind of shape it to my eye, to my eyeball. Let me see if I need to trim it. I don't like trimming them. I bought some lashes one time. They were kind of pricey. And I ruined them. I have to use a tool. Thank you, Elizabeth. I just don't wear red very much. I don't know. Maybe because it's a... Uh, I feel like it's an attention getter. I'm kind of hiding, you know? All right, let's see here. Let's see if I need to trim these dudes. Put it up there. It's going to be close, but I'm going to try not to trim them to start with. All right, let's put the glue on it real quick, and it says five seconds. That could be a positive, and it could be a negative. Now, it has been weeks since I have used glue lashes, because I've been experimenting with these magnetic lashes and something has broke my eyelid out and so I haven't been wearing the magnetic liner for a few days so my eyes clearing up so I must be I must have a problem with it okay one thousand one one thousand two one thousand three one thousand four one thousand five I can't imagine I can put that on right now Okay, I put my little tool right smack dab in the middle. And I may end up having to cut these, but I'm not going to do it right now, okay? I'm just going to go in the center of the eye. Push. Oh, dear. Push, push. Yeah, I think that eventually I'm going to have to cut these little things. Wiggle, wiggle. Give it a little wiggle and that kind of helps it. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Hold it down a minute. It's always the corners that get me. Oh, these are big. Yeah, I think I do need to trim them. Maybe one little tiny section. Pretty awesome. Oh, it's sticking me. Yeah, if it sticks you in here, you know you have gone too far over or you need to trim them little rascals. But for today, they don't look too bad, do they? Let me look up. <gasps> Testing two things here. Yeah, number one, that's sticking me. Ouch. So I'll cut it. Ugh. Maybe I can tough it out today. Maybe I should cut this one because I'm going to definitely cut the other one, right? Gosh, they got them on there, so I fear, fear I'm going to tear it up. Oh, that's sticking me, okay. Let's trim you up just a fraction. It's always scary to trim lashes because I ruined an expensive pair one time. And I'm only going to get one little section. Ooh. Okay. Now, 
now. You don't want to trim from the inside, so I've been told. You want to trim from the outside. This is really a different kind of applicator than KISS. KISS has, it's like a brush. I don't know what this is. Tap it on there. Okay. This is Duo Quick. Okay, 1001, 1002, 1003, 1004, 1005. A little longer than five, I guess. And think about using these little uh, tools. You want to make sure that you don't have any glue when you did your first application, because if you do, it's going to take this right off. I didn't ruin it. The middle, wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle. Get down there, wiggle, wiggle. What if it's five minutes from the time you put it on or five minutes from the time you put it on your eye? Uh, it's the ends that get me outer end and the inner end. <laughs> oh, I may have to cut this one before I can wear it today. Another thing I like to do, I'll show you. Push it. You can feel it. You can feel it feels firm when you push it. Yeah, I'm going to have to take this one off. It's sticking me. I won't get anywhere. Oh. Whoa. Now that glue. hope it don't take my eyelashes. Okay, I'm going to trim it. Just touch it up a little bit. See the difference lashes make? Just put a little bit more on. And remember, I probably just took off my eyeliner. But like I said, if I was going out, I would fix it. But I'm not going out. You're lucky I'm dressed. Usually, if I don't have to go to work, I just kind of chill in my jammies all day. Nobody sees me, anywho. Staying down pretty good. Wiggle, wiggle. Oh, see what I was talking about by having glue on your tool? That's what I mean. Also, a good tip is to, um, if you do lashes especially, to tight line. Man, that, this stuff, once you get it on there, you better have it. I think you better have it where you want it. And you can always go back after the glue dries. You can always go back and touch up your eyeliner, but I don't know. I'm not going to do it today. How's that? One little tip. Another little tip is take your eyeliner. Let's see which one this one is. Okay, it's the push up. And touch it up right in here. I want it to blend. I don't want to. I don't want you to see a chopped off lash. You know what I'm going to do to this lip color here? I'm going to tone this down just a little bit with a, a 
with one of my lip glosses. And I lost my label on my lip gloss, guys. So I just want to be subtle here. Let's just use the Dusty Rose one. I just can't do red. I wear red clothes. There's something about a red lip. You know, I think I'm liking that glue, guys. I think, I think. What do you think? Oh, you know what? Hang on, Jesse. Why don't I put some of that, uh... Let's see what it looks like on the lip. By George. <laughs> Doesn't say how to do it, so I may be doing it totally wrong. If any of you guys know how to do it, you can let me know. I am open to instructions. Use the side. I use the silver cosmic. Let's see what it does. Oh. <laughs> mm -hmm. Look at this show you this picture don't think I'd be interested in doing this but look look at that and I think they probably used they probably used that smoky color which I don't have this is a cosmic that I'm using and this is the eye I was going for see her eye see how pretty of course you know good and well photography can change things Now I'll put some lip gloss on. <laughs> that made it a that made it a lavender, didn't it? Let's do some dusty rose. No, is it dusty rose? Yeah. What that did was make it a little more creamy. I just used a touch. Now that toned it down, didn't it, girls? Well. I think I'm done, unless I forgot something. What do you think? We have beautiful cream eyeshadows, too. I could have blended in some cream eyeshadows with this stuff, and it would have been good. I just wanted to show you the new pigments. I'll be getting more colors. We will play. We will play with these. This is Cosmic and Eclipse that I used today, and pineapple. I used pineapple. Pineapple was the yellow. Yeah. Any questions? Is anybody even still here with me? <laughs> oh, look at me. Shoot. Do you still want to take the time to see what I got today? Do you want to do it? Do you want to see it? Yes? You want to see my haul? Or do you want to, you want, want to do it another day? I'll let you choose. I'll let you choose. Oh, I may got some glue up here. This Noe is uh, someone requested that I do the VFX. So this was the VFX today. I used the color number 202. Yep. Do y'all want do y'all want to see my box or do you want to do it another day? Hey Noe! I wish you were on my little teen girl. I wish, I wish, I wish. Hi Kay. I'm just not seeing everybody. Hi Marty. Marty, you are the sweetest thing. Marty is way up there, guys, in the company. She's a director, or what are you now? Are you higher than a director? And she always comes and takes the time and visits my little page. I don't know if she's still here or not, but she did, she does. Yes, she's so sweet. 
Want to see my haul, Elizabeth? Okay, I'll show you my haul. It's probably going to just be me and you. That's okay. All right. Now, this, some of this stuff I just reordered because I use it and I love it. One of the things is, is the toothpaste, the tea tree oil toothpaste. I love this stuff. Yes, I am a pharmacy toothpaste girl. This is something else that I'm crazy about. Is this right here. This is horse chestnut balm balsam. It's two times double effect. And it's a massage gel, but it's it's awesome for, um, it promotes relaxation, like tense muscles and stuff like that. So I use it on my uh, legs because I sit all day at work and then I come home and I'm up and it's not, no time before my legs are just really bothering me. So thank you, Elizabeth. I love you coming too. So I've been putting this stuff on my legs. Um, it's a relax, it definitely relaxes you and it, uh, you have to really wash your hands afterwards. It's called Double Effect, I don't even know how to say this, P-F-E-R-D-E, -E, I have no idea, balsam formula. It's enriched with horse chestnut extract, St. John's wort, and also mint, menthol, and essential oils, and it promotes a relaxing massage, good for achy muscles anywhere. Yeah, and uh, it's got ar arnica, ar arnica, something like that, and rosemary extracts to moisture and nourish the skin. Yes, and you just apply it onto the skin as, as you need it, you know. It's got, oh my gosh, and it smells wonderful. It's extremely cooling, you know, whenever you put this on. You know, you've, you've um, what's the name of that stuff? Uh, like BioFreeze, and it's, it's real cold when you put it on. And this is like that. Yes, it's really beautiful. So I've, I have almost gone through one of these huge tubes. Look at this tube. Just check this out, man. It's a huge tube. Yeah, big tube. Definitely. Oh, and they also have another one. And I've just had some samples of this one. This one is paprika and chili balsam. Uh, this one they say is really good. Like one of my uh, girls is using it on her cellulite, and she said the cellulite's not gone yet, but it's she can definitely see a difference in her cellulite. And she said I could kick myself because I did not take a before picture, but she is going to take an after picture. So you know I trust her. She's ex she is excited about um, pharmacy as I am. This one, it says, perfect fit after long, stressful days. So I, I've not used this on my legs, so I'm going to try it yet on my legs. Formulated with red chili and ginger and nettle and menthol and numerous essential oils. And it soothes the body. And it can be easily absorbed and provides a relaxing massage. And you be sure and wash your hands with this one, too, I bet. Yeah, another huge, big tube. Look at that. Love it. And guess what? I'm going to show you that last. I'll show you last. Um, <laughs> you're going to laugh. You are going to laugh at me. Oh, I thought here, I thought I was ordering, this is what I thought I was ordering, face wipes, right? Because we have face wipes now. And what I was ordering all the time was called intimate care wipes. Well, all us girls can use intimate care wipes, right? Alcohol-free, paraben-free, dye-free. You know, it's just that I thought it was face wipes. <laughs> so I don't want to use this on my face, that's for sure. But I thought for sure that's what I ordered. But, hey, I'll use them. pH, gynecology tested, hypoallergenic, safe for everyday use. Yes. There's 20 wipes in a package. And I'd have to look up for you to see how much something is. And like I said, I haven't opened this one up, so I don't know what order they got stuff in. Hopefully, it's basically the same, maybe. I don't know. Oh, wait. That's C. Tuna. Dr. Tuna. We're in Dr. Tuna stuff right now. What was that? Oh, look at that. Ah, look at that. It comes in a bottle. Can you see that? It comes in a... A push bottle. Shoot, I didn't see that. Free of dye, sulfate, paraben, free of SLES, whatever that is. Free of SLS, whatever that is. Oh my gosh, they only retail for $5.90. Good grief. 
Now this big bottle, which is a 7.6 fluid ounce bottle, that's a big bottle, is $14.90. Oh, it's new too to us. It's a pH balance formula. It helps to gently cleanse the external intimate areas. <gasps> Provides a feeling of freshness, suitable for daily use. Comes in 20 in a pack. Yes. Pretty cool. Okay, that's not what I was looking for though. Mm -mm. I was looking for... <laughs> oh my gosh. Hang on, I'm looking for that. What was that? Listen, I gotta look at this catalog because we've got some new stuff. Okay, here is about, comes in a, a gel and it also comes, uh, in, other, in other words, it comes in a container that, that's like this. This is calendula, calendula. It comes in like this kind of stuff, but it also comes in the gel that you squeeze out of the tube, which I like. So, paprika and chili. Let's see what it says. Ideal for energetic massage with its special contents. Paprika and chili balsam is enriched. enriched. I already read that to you. It's got all those ingredients in it. <sighs> Delivers a fresh feeling. Enhances perfect massage. <sighs> yes. Soothes the body. Yes, it sure does. Now, the tube that I showed you, that great big humongous tube, is $11.90. 8.5 fluid ounces. Yes. And then the other kind I told you about that I just showed you, it's $16.90. Oh, well, anywho, you want the tube anyway because it's double effect in the tube. Yeah. And then let's see what the horse chestnut says. The horse chestnut is ideal for relaxing massage with special contents. I think I just read that. Oh, after a daily workout, long hour standing up, long hour sitting down, that's, that's, the horse chestnut's going to be good for your legs and stuff. Yes. Yes. The tube is double whammy versus the little jar. Same price, $11.90. Oh, we got this. And I use this. This lavender spray goes on my pillow at night. Lavender dreams. We got so many fun things. Got a foot series, peeling salt. We got stuff for men. Oh, yeah. Perfume. Oh, my yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Alrighty. Now, let's see what we got. This is a reorder for me. This is my backup uh, primer. I always use primer. And then I've got all these pigments. These different colored pigments. I've got multiples of some of them. Man, you got to be careful when you're ordering, you know? Watch that little hot finger. These are... <laughs> pigments and most of it is multiple pigments the same same one and then I'll show you this this I ordered I now have them all we have the mono eyeshadows that uh, come like this you know singles like that and then we also have the little trios like this so I now have there's four trios I now have them all four and a couple of them are real similar um, so you know pick it pick the one you want the most that you like the most because they are kind of similar this one is really sparkly look at this one can you see it's not it's really kind of a rose color maybe in the middle but I want to show you it's really shiny and pretty and this is called the sunset kiss one but it's real similar one of these. Now, this is my smoky palette. I use this one all the time. I like to use the white right there to highlight the under the brow right there. It does beautiful. And let's see. Yeah. These are kind of similar. This has a darker brown in it, but it still has that pretty little brighter rose, maybe. And this one's called uh, Vintage Season. And then this one more here, this one is very similar also, but it has more of a brownish. They're not really shiny. They're more brown. And this one is called Vice Brown. Yeah, so I now 
have all four. All right, what else did I get? Oh, yeah. Oh, 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 I got some garlic soap. This is a garlic and ginseng soap for all hair types. Is this a shampoo? I thought it was, it's a bar soap. What? What? Say what? I gotta look that up. I have the tea tree oil bar soap and I have uh, one of these other ones and they are, oh, it is, they feel so good. And they suds up good too, you know. Does very many people use bar soap anymore? Well, these are absolutely made with loving care. If I can find the soap, where would the soap be? Is it Dr. Tuna? Maybe it's not in the catalog. Let me look. It should be, but maybe it's not. I apologize for taking time to look in the catalog, but you know perfume section, men's section, hair section, <sighs> foot care. I probably passed it up. There's those massage gels, revitalizing shampoo and the oil and the mask, double effect, revitalizing shampoo, double effect, double effect. They got small bottles and big bottles and mm, charcoal series, calendula series. I was calling it, um, oh, well, look at here. They show you, oh, how awesome. They show you what kind of skin types. This little thermometer thing. I bet my soap's not in here. The tea tree oil soap is in here. What I was going to tell you about the tea tree oil. Uh, some of the girls are saying because the tea tree oil is antibacteria fighting that you can use the tea tree oil to clean your brushes. Yeah, so I happen to have two. So when I get done with what I'm using now, there's my beloved Rose series. Oh. <sighs> I don't think my soap's going to be in here. Intimate care. Eh, eh, eh. Where is my fountain big and soap? Maybe they don't have it in the catalog. Baby soap. Here's the baby line. We got a baby line now. I don't know if you can see that. Baby oil. Here's baby soap. It's a bar soap. Here is baby lotion, baby shampoo. <sighs> All right. I'm not seeing the soap. I guess it's online. Maybe it's not available to the public yet. I'll have to check that out. Anyway, we'll figure it out. All right. And I got free, two things free because my order reached a certain limit. <laughs> my order reached a certain limit. So I got a free Age Reverses serum. I don't know if you can see that. Free serum and a free Time Locker setting spray. Yes. Oh, and I got some more. I got some calendula face and body oil. Yes. I love how you do in these series now. You got your face wash, so you wash your face. And then you want to use your like tonics and stuff like that. You do that first to, to balance your pH and your skin. And then you would do your oils or serums. And then you do your moisturizer. So now I have the calendula oil. I have the calendula tonic I call it. Let's see what they call it. Yeah, face tonic calendula. And then I have the calendula as you can see I've been using it because it's gone. Face cream. It's deep hydration. So now I have another one, a backup. So and then I got a whole bunch of samples. I've got some samples promised to some sweet people, so i got to get them samples out. And they're missing something I ordered. I'm kind of upset about that, but good grief. I ordered a ton of stuff. And I think that's about it, guys. Just my samples are in here. So, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll put one of these intimate care things in the bathroom. And I'm going to try... I use, faithfully use the horseradish, 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 I have food on the brain, I have a new Ninja Foodie and a new uh, 
instant pot. So I've been kind of cooking up a storm. And so now I got food on the brain. But this is horse chestnut balsam. <laughs> All right. And then my toothpaste is going to go in the bathroom too. And then that's back up, back up. And then this is what I'm going to try on my legs. Yeah. Okay. I think that's it, guys. Pretty much. Yeah, buddy. Anybody have any questions about any of this stuff? <sighs> Thank you for coming. Thank you so much for coming. Share, 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 share. This is Marsha Holland, Glam Memo. Look me up on YouTube. Uh, Glam Memo. I put all my videos on, on YouTube. So, yeah. If you miss them on my page, you can always catch me on YouTube. Okay? All right. Anybody have any questions? Going, going, going. Hi, Rebecca. Your dad's doing pretty good, considering. Uh, Parkinson's and Lewy body disease. That is not something that is fun. Not fun at all. Yeah. Okay. I don't see any comments, so I'm going to cut out of here. Thank you so much again for visiting with me. I love you very much. Thank you for sharing. Thank you for all your love. And look at my crazy eyelashes. I think I can wear them to work. Why not? They do tickle my eyebrow a little bit, but not, not much. I'll talk to you later, okay? I love you. Bye. From Pharmacy. Love you.